So Cranex uploaded a video not that long ago. It was, it was about him basically explaining the condition the hive is in. Then he talked about an idea. He talked about a great idea. The idea was to have um, I have UHC. Now if you don't know what UHC is, basically back in the day, back in the Hypixel days, there was this game mode called UHC and it'd basically be Minecraft Battle Royale. In the sense where you'd have to mine your own loot, get your own stuff, build your own items. It's like actual Minecraft for by people. Bro, why try so hard? No, if you guys have watched me before, you know, you know I've had my opinions on Cranex and the other hype YouTubers on the mainstream side of things, especially Cranex. But the thing is, I have to agree with Cranex's idea on this one. I really do think that UHC could save the hive. Like, I know it's been dead for a couple of months now, it's been dead for a couple of years now, but you know how, you know what they did with Sky Wars, they reinvented the game basically. They could do that with UHC, they could add their own special twist on it. And with Hive PvP, Hive Knockback, it could be really insane, it could honestly blow up again. Now one problem we do have though is that Hive already said a couple of years ago that they weren't going to add UHC. Now I don't know if it's a definite 100% but that's what they did say and this guy has a very naughty skin. Wow, well, we're just gonna take this guy out first then we'll deal with that, that not so good person. Okay, buddy, I don't want to say your name for obvious reasons but yeah that skin is very naughty mate, very naughty. That's what you get for being racist. As I was saying, I'm not sure if it's a definite 100% on that, on that note from high. Obviously, times change, and anything can happen in the future, given enough time, but... We're just gonna have to see, won't we? Okay. Wait, knock back? I'm coming for you. One problem I know the Hive would have would be timing. Uh, the timing has to be perfectly, perfectly in sync with everything. Like, I'm not, I'm not calling the Hive st staff team dumb, yeah? They are incredibly smart people and they are talented people, but I just think they're lazy. Like, in all honesty, I just think they don't give a shit. Like a single flying fuck. If they did, we'd, we'd have a lot more updates coming out. Or maybe they're not lazy, but they're a lot more unorganized than they would have us believe. Which wouldn't be surprising to me, considering they have really just done nothing these past two years. This is gonna be my last game, since <clears throat> my girlfriend wants to go. That's right guys, he's got a girl, and she's real. You know, I know the topic was supposed to be about the how UHC can save Hive, but let's just, let's just backtrack for a second here. I wonder what the Hive actually- I wonder what the Hive staff team actually do in their spare time. They're obviously not making updates, so. Like, what are they actually doing? And what is this guy doing? Look at him, look at him, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Hive players are funny. I'm guessing if they were to actually release Hive UHC, it'd take something about like- I'd actually estimate it'd take like two years for them to actually make it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's being reasonable. I mean, you guys tell me, how long would you think it would actually take for them to release her UHC? Let's say if it, if it was a plan. Like, they said they would release swarms ages ago, and they just kept pushing it forward until they eventually cancelled it. What the? I was just buying some loot, and then this guy popped up out of nowhere. Oh, why does he have to suck? I was hoping for a good final fight, but... Uh, oh well. Good fight. If you guys enjoyed that video, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.